Hello and welcome back to my Rimworld Let's Play series where we are picking up kind of where we left off in the last episode. In the last episode there was a huge fire, I believe it was over here. Yeah, what's that? Burnt tree, interesting. Um, but yes, it's been a little while. As you can see they have cut down a bunch of wood and it's it's not been too long, like a minute or two <laughs> to be honest. Research is going nicely. Um, I am waiting for this to finish so we can get auto doors and then microelectronics so we can start producing our own components, which is going to be amazing. But in this episode mainly, we are going to. Um, I think we will. I know these are dangerous sometimes, can be, and because this is a big one. I am not a hundred percent happy about opening this one. I want to open it really badly to see what's inside it, but it's also very dangerous, or might be anyway. Um, and then, but these smaller ones might be just a little bit, eh, kind of maybe boring. I don't know. But I think we'll start with one of the smaller ones. I'm just waiting for. Why is he in that bit? Oh, that. Yeah. They had an infection. She and... Who was it? Uh, the Eclipse Sending. Nice. We get some sunlight. I'm just really waiting... In, wait, wait, uh, can't speak. Waiting for the rain to end. What are you doing? I'm not happy about these wolves. Um, yeah. Wait. What's up with... Oh! Um, rest until healed and crafter. You will take care of law. Oh dear, I thought he was... Huh. Maybe it skipped my mind. <laughs> okay, and crafter. Drop the wood. Tend to law. Okay, that's um, that was, that's not good. Okay then, um, I do want to make a perimeter wall as well around the base to protect us, but I do want to bust open some of these to see what's inside them. But I'm not sure I am willing to open the big one, especially because two of our guys are down. Um, they have not been healed completely yet. The infection is still there, as you can see there. Um, and law is down as well. It has been tempted to, but it's still there. And Kisaki and law are two of the guys that we have that, um, what? Will you please? Remain in bed. <laughs> Stop working. Kisaki is one of our guys with um, an auto pistol and law has a bow with pretty good range. Crafter has a rifle and Wurzer has a gun as well, a revolver I'm pretty sure. Yeah, but that is pretty much the shooting guys that we have. Then we have Johnny and Fringin that um, has knives, which isn't as effective I'd say. Rest until healed. Oh, why? Uh, where's Crafter? There we go. That should work. Okay. So, yeah, with this going on, I'm not sure that I'm willing to... Um... Ooh. That's a long name. <laughs> Uh, bulk goods trader from liberal unification of southeastern Ariberon. Okay. Whoa, that's a huge convoy. Okay, that's a big convoy. Hmm. Um, but it's good because they might be able to sell us um components. So we'll have to see. Have to get crafter to. 
to um, to communicate with them. So this guy right here is the trader. What are you gonna do? You gotta trade. Okay, let's see. Okay. Okay. Let's see what we get. Okay, so they do have components for 32, um, I believe 32 silver. So it says positive numbers, numbers buy, negative numbers sell. So I'm selling some silver. But if I do this, I would get 10 silver, but I would lose one component. So, I mean, we need the components. How many do they have? They have 38. <laughs> um, I could buy five. Let's buy five. Accept. There we go. I'm not sure where they are going to dump it. But I'm pretty sure they will dump it somewhere. I'm pretty sure it won't just magically go into our stockpile. What's that doing? Okay, wondering. Good. Um, so yeah, I'm guessing they'll just leave it in the middle of the street, I was going to say, but we don't have a street. So yeah. Anytime now. Anytime now. It's not here yet. Okay. Oh, there. Five. Okay. Those need to be hauled right away. Oh, okay. No matter. <laughs> so yeah, with all this going on, I do want to bust one of these open. I think I will. Hoping that Lauren Kisaki will um, will get better so we can do it. Um, yeah, and I want these to be hauled ASAP because it's deteriorating due to being unroofed, which is not great. Um, sorry, Crafter, all those components they are very important, mean a lot to us, and I want him to take a look again so trade with him once more because I want to see what else they got um, uh, this stuff is expensive though I was thinking about maybe some armor or something but they don't seem to have that so you know what it doesn't matter get away with that uh, how the health Apparently not good. Um, this thing keeps getting back to untreated. That's very annoying. But I guess it takes the time it takes <laughs> in order to go away. Urgently hungry, oh dear. Sick and disturbed sleep, yeah. He needs to get some food, crafter. Man, get this man some food. <laughs> uh, man, okay. Well then. Ooh, perfect. Auto doors, auto doors, where is it? <laughs> I want auto doors. Um, okay, they are leaving. Auto doors. There we go. Research. So we can now make carpets. Um, which is good. Okay, how about her needs? Sick, feeling bad. Loin and. Um, yeah. Sick and disturbed sleep. Not good. Okay, now how do we then make. Then there must be a carpet thing here, maybe? Uh. I'm guessing it's this. Um, or not. It can't be the machine table. Okay, so in production, sculptures table, we have that. That's this one. Butcher, hand tailor, we got that one. Maybe we need the ele electric. 
Hmm. I don't know. It's that sculpture, it's that the butcher table, hand tailor, electric tailor. Uh. Let's deconstruct that one and let's get an electric one just in case. I could imagine that might be the issue. Now this is costing us three components, but we can always deconstruct it hopefully. Plus it's kind of worth it, I think, because it'll speed up the process a lot. Um, oh, it just disappeared. That was not me because I clicked on it. Okay. <laughs> um, I do not believe that it is something that we have to operate. Ooh, a small herd of thrombos have wandered into the area. Peaceful by nature, these rare creatures are extremely dangerous when confronted. Some traders are willing to pay a lot of money for their precious leather and horn. Yeah, I will not attack those. They're beautiful. So, they are welcome to stay as long as they want to. Okay, so that'll be crafted at some point. <laughs> I just got a minor break risk warning from Kisaki. Um, originally hungry. Oh dear. Um, are you? Yeah. Um, what's that? What are you gonna do? Um, only component. Nope. Oh, not a science doctoring, really. Um. Well, if he's really bad at it, I suppose. Johnny, can you do it? Johnny? Nope. Okay. Crafter, before that, feed Kisaki quickly. Before something bad happens. Starvation. Yes, I know. She's getting food now. What now? <laughs> uh, man. This is stressing. I just want this infection to disappear. I don't want it to be here. I just want it to go away. Mm, I could really use a break for something enjoyable. Yeah, I just don't know. Mm. I guess I could install... There is something I think I saw with installing a TV or something. I'm not sure where it was. But that would be pretty cool if we could get that. That's going to slow down time a bit. Okay. Perfect. Pause that. Let's just check here. Okay, jacket, duster, button down t-shirt. No carpets. Okay, that's strange. Okay, let's see. What are the research? Microelectronics basics research. Now, how on earth do we then create carpets? It's not in sco stone cutters. Not that either. I'm confused. I have to do some research on that. Um, okay, cleaning stuff yeah we can't really open one of these up as long as these guys are still what's that something is being killed yes oh dear um yeah we can't really do much while these two are in bed okay i'm now back and i did a little bit of research to this malaria infection that we have going on here in our colonists um, and I'm looking at the RimWorld wiki right now and it says um, where does it say it treatment above 68.5 percent can halt and reverse the symptoms of the disease and it takes around eight three point eight days to develop immunity to malaria so next time Crafter goes ahead and takes care of these 
these two. Um, we'll have to see how high the percentage is. Good, it says good treatment can slow the disease to the point where it starts to regress. Um, I believe Crafter's treatment is over 70%, but we'll have to see about that when um, when we get to that point. I did not research any anything about um, carpets, but we should be good for now. I, wait a second. Don't tell me it's in here all the time. Floors. <laughs> okay, so we have these. And... Oh, you gotta be kidding me. It's been in here the whole time. Okay. Um, never mind then. Okay, so we can just get this carpet here. It's casting cloth, of course. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Um, we got dark carpet, cream carpet, blue carpet, green carpet, and red carpet. Um... That carpet might look pretty good in here. Um, how much cloth do we have anyways? 163. Okay, let's try and put in... Um, let's try to add... Cream carpet to this area here. Just for the fun of it. Okay, where are you going? Okay, cooking. Okay, that's good. I just want to see how the carpet looks just to get a better idea of it. So, if the treatment has gone good, then it should... They should develop a... Immunity to it pretty soon, hopefully. Um, yeah, but we'll have to see how fast. Oh dear. Fire. The rain is putting out though, which is perfect. So there's a lot of thunderstorm and it's speed up sped up like this. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. A lot of thundering. So I'm sorry that I said in the beginning that we would we would be going into one of these and then not, but um different set of events over here. But we do have the carpet, so which is pretty cool. Ooh, loss up. Wait. Yes, developed immunity. Okay, now we just need to get Kisaki out of that bit. <laughs> okay, perfect. Crafter's treatment has been very good, apparently. Um, what's he doing now? Wait, don't you need? Oh wait. Yes. Immunity developed. Nice, we are back in action. Phew, okay. So I'm not sure how long this episode is, depending on what I'm... I might be cutting some stuff um, out of the video, but I'm not sure yet. So I don't know how long this is going to take, but I want to see the carpet being laid. Um, I want to see how it looks. Okay. Also, we are all, all, almost already done with the... Okay, we're not almost done, but it's going fast in micro... Um, electronics, is it called? Yeah, micro -el electronics. Well, that looks good, actually. Um, okay. Let's just try... Well, we don't have that much cloth, to be honest. We have more over here, though. So let's try and put cream carpet this entire way here. Just for the fun of it. And we'll see what happens. <laughs> um, yeah, Frenchy is going to continue researching and this is going to be done. This is going to be interesting. Let's speed up time a lot and see what happens. This is looking pretty good. Ooh! <gasps> Colnets are gathering to celebrate Kiseki and Hertha's marriage. Oh! Wait, where are they going? I want to see it. I want to see it. Attending marriage ceremony. Why are you researching? <laughs> there. Go ahead. Go. There we go. Nice. Wow. 
Okay, so that's cool. So they're doing it in here, which is actually pretty fine, fine by me that they are in here doing it. Um, actually, we should get some more. Um... Okay, well then, they got it, their immunity done right in time, I suppose. Okay, so turn around like that and put just a few extra chairs in like that. All right. Let's look at the happiness. Uh, a tent party. Somewhat impressive dining room. That's good. Um, rec room. I'm not sure what the rec room is, but okay. Optimist. Extremely comfortable. Tons of joy. Nice. Okay, they are beginning their ceremony. That's nice. Oh, it says down here, Mary. Cool. Awesome. Well, I guess for that, we need to upgrade this over here. So, I guess we need to get rid of that. Um, Guess can we reinstall down here? Yeah. Um, do we want the room to be this one or this one? I'm thinking this one or this one. Uh, right, left, right, right. <laughs> so if we uninstall that and then we get a new one put in. Nice. Okay, in the middle of the carpet laying as well. Perfect. <laughs> okay, so we got some good stuff out of this video. Um, the disease got removed and yeah, they're getting married. And married colonists are now celebrating the occasion. Nice. Unfortunately, we do not have any cake, but okay, it just said it in here. Social husband, yeah, and this one, yeah, it does cool. Okay, I want this removed so we can get a double bit in there. Wow, their mood is high. I don't want daytime, really. <laughs> oh well. I guess it can be annoying for him. Also, we need to get all this stuff indoors. Oh dear. Deteriorating a lot. Okay. Let's speed up things. I don't want to break the party or anything, but um, still. You know what I think? Actually, I'm going to call it an episode here. I'm not sure again how long this video is going to be, but um, I think I'm going to call it here, yeah. And then... We'll see what happens in the next episode. In the next episode, I might do this off camera right here and get all this stuff in there. But I'm almost expecting a raid pretty soon, but I'm not sure. I'm going to quit it and save it before anything happens. I hope you enjoyed. Next episode, we are probably going to bust open one of those again. Let me know which one of them you think we should do, the big one or the smaller ones first. Let me know down in the comments. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you next time. Remember to leave a like if you did enjoy and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Anyways, have a nice day. Bye bye.